I'm just gonna get like a couple more reincarnation scriptures just to drive the point home, man. Revelation chapter one, like this is, this isn't, this isn't even uh, meat, man. Reincarnation is really milk. That's it's really uh, basic. I mean, it, it it could reincarnation could get uh, deep. Like there's certain aspects about it that, that could that could get deep, but on the sur on the on the surface, like it's really not even that that hard. It's pr it's pretty uh, basic. Uh, this is Revelation. But I, but I just say the water Yahweh, the water Yahweh Shai for revealing it to me. Like the water Yahweh, the water Yahweh Shai. You, you, you really, you just gotta thank the Lord, man, that, that He revealed it to you. You really just gotta thank the Lord. Like you, you can't get uh, proud, that, proud that you uh, had this knowledge. You just gotta thank the Lord that He opened up uh, our eyes to see it. Lord, Lord willing, I'm a part of the elect. You just gotta uh, thank the Lord that that uh, He opened your. He opened your eyes and gave you understanding. Because like, like I could have been like that, that I could have been like that nigga saying, um, saying the reincarnation isn't biblical. As a matter of fact, I just thought of a scripture. Uh, I just thought of a scripture for dudes like that. Because that's that's also a, a prophecy. Do, do, dudes like that that's that's a uh that's a part of prophecy man this is romans chapter uh seven. Oh, salakia it's i'm tripping it's um uh, it's romans chapter 11 verse 7 it says what then israel have not obtained that which he seeketh for but the election hath obtained it and the rest were blinded so it says israel have not obtained that which he seeketh for what is it, what is the thing that, that uh Israel seeks for? The truth. Because like before uh we came in, before the Lord woke us up to this truth, we, we were uh searching. We were searching for uh for, for truth, and that's what that's talking about. Well what, what then had hath Israel um uh what then Israel have not obtained that which he seeketh for. And this is speaking about the two thirds because the elect ha hath obtained it. Because we, we were seeking just like the two thirds were, but the only difference between uh Lord willing, I'm a part of the elect. The only difference is the Lord, uh, the Lord revealed it to us, and He didn't reveal it to, to the two thirds. And that's what that's what that's uh, going into. The Lord uh, blinded them. Verse eight. It says, according as it is written, the Most High hath given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear, unto this day. And and that's why niggas. That's why niggas can't get it, man. That's why no matter how how hard you try to, uh, no matter how like I straight up I I, I well I didn't I didn't uh, show it but I posted the scriptures to prove that reincarnation is biblical and he still didn't get it man, <laughs> he still didn't get it man and and then uh, and then Amos chapter three, like no matter how, how much you you try to. Uh, you try to make uh, niggas get it, they're not going to get it, man, because they're blinded. The Heavenly Father blinded. Like, like if the if the Heavenly Father Himself blinded somebody, you like, well, what makes you think that that <laughs> what makes you think that you that you can make them see? All, all, all you got, really, all, all you could do is is just like all, all you could do is just, is just <laughs> like like really, you can't you can't tell them nothing, really. All, all you could do is just like keep it moving. Well, like like the uh the elder apostles always say um um hi, high priest uh i mean uh elder Yaquab, he he always said if a nigga can't get it we moving on like that's all you could do pretty much if a nigga can't get it you all, all you could do is just move on because you can't you can't tell him nothing but this is Amos chapter 3 and verse uh 7 it says surely the lord power will do nothing but he revealed his secret unto his servants the prophets and so that, that's it pretty much i was gonna get more reincarnation scriptures but like uh <laughs> but pretty much like i already i already made the point man i'll get one more i'll get one more in uh revelation the one i was gonna get the lord's only dealing with uh with the elect
Only the elect is going to get this truth. Revelation chapter 1 and verse 7. Behold, he cometh with clouds, and every eye shall see him, and there also which pierced him. And see, this this is speaking about when Yahweh Shai comes back. It says, it says, every eye shall see him, and they also which pierced him. So even even the ones who pierced Yahweh Shai 2,000 years ago, they're going to be uh, back. They're going to be back today, and they're going to see Yahweh Shai come back. And then that proves that reincarnation, like, how how else could you explain that? Like, like you mean to tell me uh, th there's a bunch of Romans, uh, Roman centurions that are uh, two thousand years old walking around? <laughs> is that what is that what is that what you uh you uh knuckleheads, you wacky tacky Christians, and you niggas? Is that what you, what you're trying to say? That, that there's uh there's Roman Roman uh soldiers walking around that are two thousand years old. Like that that's that's ridiculous, man. Uh they're reincarnated. And like like the apostles always say, those uh soldiers that pierced the Howard Shai, they're probably like uh uh high level uh officials in the in the military. They're probably like uh like generals, they're probably like in, in a high position. Like whoever whoever those those uh Edomites are, man. And and they got they got they got a heavy judgment coming to them, who whoever those uh <laughs> whoever those bastards are, man. Shit, I would hate to be them, man, because your yeah, house is gonna mess them up, man. But yeah, that that that's pretty much the point. And I'm gonna get uh, one more reincarnation scripture. Um, let me see. <clears throat> Um Um I'm actually I'm thinking of a whole bunch now. <laughs> I'm thinking of a lot of reincarnation scriptures now, man. Uh Actually, I'm going to get uh, an even better one than this. I'm going to get an even better one. I just thought of uh let me see. I just thought of an even better one. This is uh, Revelation chapter 10. And, um, it's <coughs> lucky. And I'm going to start on, um, I'm going to start at verse 9. It says, And I went unto the angel, and this is uh, John the Revelator speaking, which which came back in a reincarnation as, as high priest Arya, for, for, those, for those who can receive it. For those who can receive it. In uh, Revelation chapter 10, verse 9, it says, And I went unto the angel, and he said unto me, I mean, it's like it, he's, and said unto him, Give me the little book. And he said unto me, Take it and eat it up. And that little book is uh, speaking about the scriptures. And, and, and what he meant by uh, eat it up is it's pretty much like, like digest it. Like, like, like get it into your mind, pretty much. Get, get, get this, uh, this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding in your mind. Uh, reading on, it says... Uh, take it and eat it up and it shall make thy belly bitter but it shall be in thy mouth sweet as honey and, and that, that's how this truth is when you first learn it man it's, it's sweet because you never heard this before like you, you never your, 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 your eyes uh, weren't open yet so so like when you when you first learn this truth like you see the whole world from a different uh, perspective you see the whole world world from a, a different uh, perspective. Like like you know you're an Israelite, <laughs> you know you know uh, you're you're uh, God's chosen people. You you know that 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 uh, that these uh, heathens are, are 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 going are going to be uh, your slaves. So when you first learn all that, man, it's sweet, man, because you never you never heard that before. But then like, uh, but then like like when you when you when you keep on enduring in this truth, like it starts getting bitter, because it's it's hard. 
it, it because this truth this truth uh starts getting like like the apostle said this, this truth um it starts being like a burden and it starts it starts getting hard so it starts getting uh bitter <clears throat> and and that's what that's where endurance uh comes in that's why the scripture says he that endures to the end shall be saved the word the word endure means to make hard so for for you to to make it in this truth you have to be hard man you have to have a uh, thick skin you have, you have to be uh, hard like a rock, man. Like Yahushai. You have to be like a great millstone. You have to be hard. You, you can't be uh, soft in this truth. You, you, you can't be uh, soft in this truth. But but uh, going back to the point, that that's what it means when it says it shall be in thy thy uh, it shall make thy belly uh, bitter, but it shall be in thy mouth sweet as honey. And, and then, like, and also, in, like, in this truth, it's not always bitter. Like, like it get, it gets, it gets sweet sometimes. Like, it's, it's like a balance. Like, it's, it's like uh, highs, highs and lows. Like, you're gonna have highs in this truth, and you're gonna have lows in this truth. That, that's, like, that, that's, that's a part of this, uh, this truth. You gotta try to uh, stay balanced, man. You gotta try to stay like, like, in between. Um, but reading on, verse ten. It says, and I took the little book out of the angel's hand and ate it up, and it was in my mouth sweet as honey. And as soon as I had eaten it, my belly was, was bitter. Verse 11, this is the point that I was trying to get about uh, reincarnation. And he said unto me, thou must prophesy again before many peoples and nations and tongues and kings. And, and there, there has never been a, a record of, of John the Revelator uh, ever prophesying again outside of um, like like there's never been any record of that in in history there's never been a record of John the Baptist uh, leaving that the island of, of Patmos because that that's where he was when he uh, wrote the book of Revelation he was a prisoner on on the isle on the island of uh, of Patmos there's no record of him ever leaving that island and prophesying again before many peoples like there's no record of that so the only explanation is. The only explanation is that he reincarnated in the times that we're in now. That like that's the only explanation. Uh, unless you wanna uh unless you wanna call the Heavenly Father a liar. So yeah, that's the point on that. And and also I wanted to uh I also wanted to get something on the famine of the word. See, this is why, uh, oh, that, that's pretty much, wait, uh, I'll play the rest. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Th this is why, um, the apostles, this is why they say, like, you have to get as much of this word uh, while you still can. It's so lucky if I'm speaking low, because, like, my throat kind of hurts right now. But, like, this is why, this is why the apostles say you have to get as much of this truth as, as you can while, while you still can, because there's going to come a time where uh you're not going to be able to to go to the store and, and uh buy buy a bible and, and like uh read it there's going to come a time where the internet is going to be uh shut down there's going to be a uh, an emp attack and it's going to take down the, the whole power grid in babylon the great which is america there's going to come a time there's going to come a time like the scripture